Welcome to twoquestions.tv. With me today is Scott Miller, and we're talking about brain performance. Welcome to twoquestions.tv. Joining me today is Scott Miller, the CEO and co-founder of Boss Level Labs, which introduced this, God Mode, a breakthrough brain supplement for gamers. Hi, Scott. Welcome to the show. Hi. Glad to be here. So, okay, first, um, let's talk about God Mode. What is it? I mean, it's, it's this. Viewers, it's this. But so what is it exactly? Well, it's a combination of... Um different um, clinically researched ingredients, natural ingredients from plants uh, uh, that um, have um, research that shows they benefit the brain in certain ways. Mm -hmm. uh, they increase neurotransmitters, they actually have um, a reparative effect on the brain. Um, and they just, individually, they all have research out there that shows they they improve cognitive performance, improve focus, reduce anxiety. So we have 14 different ingredients and each one has been selected to sort of uh, work with others synergistically and to basically uh, all together sort of complete a puzzle that, um, that would you know, improve your performance. I've been actually taking most of these ingredients separately now for 10 to 15 years. And a lot of people in, um, uh, uh, the supplements community that I that I know and uh, so on I also use these things and um, some of the, a lot of these ingredients <clears throat> are actually used in in uh, in hospitals in other countries like in Japan. <clears throat> if you come into um, the, the like the ER room and you have you've had some sort of like stroke or brain trauma from a crash, uh, some of these ingredients are immediately put into your IV like. Uh, like for instance, the blueberry extract, um, terosta bean, um, that's something that has a remarkable effect on, on uh, restoring brain function after any sort of injury. So, um, you know, these things are not generally used in the United States and most doctors in the United States generally won't know much about them and therefore they'll probably not recommend them uh, just based on ignorance, you know. The American, um, uh, pharmaceutical pharmaceutical industry has such a lock on our our our, our system here, but in socialized med, uh, medicine uh, or, or countries with socialized medicine where they just care about what works and they want to find the cheapest things that works, you'll see a lot of these ingredients used, especially like in China and India and, and other Asian countries where they they still embrace you know natural things. You know, the United States mm -hmm. is gone so far in the direction of only using big pharma uh, remedies. But um, anyway, so this is a formulation um, that we are, are, are really happy with. Um, we selected these things very carefully and, um, and you know, we, we've, we, you know, we have shown that, or we can show, uh, you know, all the studies, you know, there's over 800 studies that, that back up all these things individually. And um, so we just thought that putting them all together would make it very convenient for people to use this and get the benefit. Yeah, I imagine. I mean, there's not a small number of ingredients. I mean, um, I imagine taking them all is a lot. <laughs> yeah, so, people don't want to take, you know, 15 or 20 pills a day. So right. by combining it together into two pills, it's, it's really handy, really nice. It's interesting. And, and I will say, um, I researched, I, I, I don't, you know, I won't, I don't want to take anything unless I know exactly what's in it. So I researched every single ingredient on the label and I, I looked on, you know, I, it's Google research. Okay. So, you know, it's not amazing, you know, <laughs> but, but I did find actually almost everything was listed on WebMD and it talked about what it was, what it was for side effects, what to look about, what to look for in terms of contraindications. If you're taking this medicine, it might interact that way. It was very interesting. And, and so I actually felt quite safe taking it. Um, and, uh, I, and I, and I, I was, I was surprised at how much I accomplished in the days mm -hmm. I was consuming it. Uh, why gamers? Well, because uh, myself and my two main uh, founders uh, for this company were from the game industry. Um, mm -hmm. I've been in the game industry for 25 years 
had a lot of success there. We released a lot of major global hits. And, um, and also, um, sort of behind the scenes, I've done a lot to help other people in the game industry. You know, the game industry is notorious for people sitting behind a computer all day, you know, drinking Cokes, eating pizza, <laughs> not being healthy. So um, for the last 10 years, um, I've participated in forums where people from the game industry um, get on and we talk about, you know, issues for the game industry, but there's also, we also talk about other little issues, like we have an issue, an area where we talk about, you know, the latest movies and stuff. But one of the areas we, we have is a big health area. Mm -hmm. And there's been literally over 100,000 different messages just in that area over the last 10 years. Mm -hmm. where we talk about diet and supplements and people, you know, depression, just all these different things. And, um, and in that forum, you know, a lot of people have, have um, come around to taking supplements and, and they, they see remarkable benefits. You know, the fact is, you know, most people in the United States are deficient in vitamin D. Mm -hmm. Most people are deficient in vitamin uh, in magnesium and zinc and other things. And when your body is deficient in these things, like magnesium is involved in over 1,000 different processes that we know of, just one oh, yeah. we know of in the body. And if your body is short on these, these minerals, these key things, which are cofactors and all sorts of uh, chemical processes in your inner body and metabolism and so on, then your body's not going to run at peak efficiency or be, uh, experience what's called internal inflammation and all kinds of things. So um, I've, I've been preaching in this forum, along with other people who are very health-minded, you know, that you should, you, you should make sure that you, you, know, you have these necessary sort of ingredients in your body. Um, and, and the brain is, is an area that's really been, um, getting a lot of research in the last 10 or 15 years. And, and that's an area that should not be neglected. You know, we, we do a lot of other things for our body and the brain, you know, you don't really see too many brain supplements out there. There's a few. Um, and so I just felt like <clears throat> that, um, you know, getting this product started, given my sort of, um, I, I guess, uh, I, I don't want to say reputation, but I'm just fairly well known in the game industry. And that's where, that's where my expertise is. So I figure we'll target this product there initially, get a lot of uh, sort of uh, press from the game industry, um, mm -hmm. and then sort of branch out there from there, because it's not just good for people who necessarily want to play games and, and, get better scores for people who make games and need to really focus on, you know, coding and art and everything. You know, it's really good for, you know, anyone who just, you know, uses their mind and who doesn't use their mind, you know, but, but really, you know, we're going to start branching out to, you know, believe it or not, athletes are very interested in products like mm -hmm. this, mm -hmm. entrepreneurs, you know, uh, we're going to start reaching out to people we know in Silicon Valley, of course, students, uh, professionals, you know, there's, so we're, we're going to start branching out in that area there. Um, Good news, you already are. My audience is entrepreneurs, executives. So. Okay, fine. that's perfect then. So there you go. Um, okay, so um, so what are some of the challenges that you see really with performance and brain activity? And are, are neurotropics, the stuff that you talk about in your website, um, are, are those, the, is that the only way we can improve performance or are there other ways to improve performance as well? <clears throat> Diet is just as important. Uh, you know, diet makes a huge impact on, on your health and body. I think diet, really more than anything, is probably 70 to 80 percent of your health. Um, so I always recommend, you know, diet has to be first. If you're eating junk food, then it doesn't matter what vitamins and stuff you're taking. It's you're going to have a. You're, it's going to still be a net negative effect. Mm -hmm. um, Exercise is, you know, obviously important. I mean, these are all standard things, and I think most people know about diet and exercise for the most sure. part. Um, and so, these brain supplements are like the next step. If you, if you, you know, if you want performance benefits, you know, if you want to really sort of like, you know, a lot of people call it brain hacking and so on. If you want to like get to the next level and you have your other bases covered, then you know, supplements is probably third in the list after diet and exercise. Interesting. Interesting. I, I think that we tend to forget when we're talking about diet and exercise that 
our brains are a part of our body. And I don't know why, it just seems that every time I, I talk to someone about getting healthy and you know, thinking better and their brain working more optimally, diet and exercise, they're like, what, really? really? Oh, I never thought of it that way. Yeah, your brain's a part of your body. <laughs> yeah. It's not that your complicated. Brain's, your brain is so, um, your brain is only like 5% of your body weight, but it consumes 20% of your calories. Right. And uh, it, your brain is the only organ in your body that requires um, sugars to run off of. Your, the rest of your body can run off of fatty acids. Mm -hmm. I mean, <clears throat> so humans actually, we don't need to eat carbs at all to survive. Uh, and, and under that situation, your body will actually make enough glucose to keep your brain alive. It's so mm -hmm. important. Uh, for your brain to, to get about 50% carbs. The problem is that a lot of people eat way too many carbs and their brain will actually use carbs as a preferential metabolic fuel. The right. problem with carbs though is that they cause a lot more metabolic waste. And since your brain is using so many carbs, if you provide your body with carbs, your brain gets sort of gunked up. The cleaning mm -hmm. mechanisms in your brain get overwhelmed and that's actually what leads to Alzheimer's and, uh, and other, other issues. Uh, mm -hmm. Alzheimer's has actually been called type three diabetes mm -hmm. uh, by a lot of doctors. Um, Interesting. I do uh, miss, I do miss the ketogenic diet so much. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's, I mean, I've got, I've, I've actually got a couple of friends who have been on that diet now for two years straight. Yeah. Um, and I've done it for like several months at a time when I want to lose a little bit of weight. Yeah. Um, but, um, but that's like, but like, for instance, if you're, that just shows that if your diet is bad, if you're eating a lot of carbs, a lot of sugars, you're going to overwhelm your brain with sugars over time and your brain's going to, going to experience some, some malfunctions at some point that can't, can't be helped. Um, so that's why diet is, is really number one. Plus, you know, you get a lot of your nutrients through diet too. And, um, so, so God mode is not sort of like some panacea that's going to, that's going to help you if you're failing in other areas. Right. So there you go. Right. Get healthy, eat healthy, exercise, then supplement. Yep. Makes sense. Makes sense. Scott, thank you for joining me on the show today. Well, I'm glad to be here, Susan. All right, viewers, this is God Mode. We're going to have a link to the website down below in the show notes for today so that you can get yours and try it. But make sure you're eating healthy and exercising first. It makes sense. <laughs> All right. Thanks Bye -bye. for watching. We'll see you next time.